Water signs. Welcome, y'all. I'm glad you're here. Let me grab y'all's affirmation today. I'm sorry I left it over here. Turn my phone down. Okay. All right. Your affirmation for day today is wax on, wax off. Wax the hell off the task at hand. Okay, water sign. So you about to show up and show out is what I'm feeling. I love the energy. I love the vibes, y'all. I love the vibes already. So <clears throat> whatever's going on in your energy at this time is what we're checking on. See what, how your week may go. Some things may make themselves known during this week. One eleven on the timer. You may be seeing the synchronicity. All right, y'all. We got some some stuff going on as we close out the year. Happy birthday to all the Sagis. That there may be someone cross watching. It's my mom and them birthday, y'all. <laughs> I love it. I love the vibes. Having rest, they beautiful souls. Her and her twin sister. Love them. All right, y'all. I have already prayed and saved off camera, as I do every reading. If this is your first time, welcome to the Phoenix Tarot Tribe. Over here, baby, you'll love it. We are doing the best we can with what we got. We're healing and growing together as we support each other. Spirit guides and ancestors, show us what we need to know from our water love. Okay, that one, I don't know what it was doing. Okay, that's what I do know. Okay, so we ended up with four. Oh, look at y'all. Ah, magical blessings, baby. All right. I haven't got too excited. Okay. Stargazing. When you gaze at the stars, you give yourself fairy focus. Your intuition will flow more freely and reveal what you need to know about your situation. Okay, y'all. This sound like stop overthinking it. Hmm. <laughs> two, two, two on the timer. Okay, baby. I love that. Nature's signs. Be receptive to the subtle messages from nature as you go about your day. Nature talks to us continually. We need to open our hearts and our mind. Okay, somebody may be seeing a lot of animals. Yes, I do believe that these are some type of badger or something, but that does not mean that. You you may have animals drawn to you because you're vibrating highly. I know. <laughs> Y'all, in this one video, I told this story, so I'm telling the show. So when I first began my um, spiritual journey after going through my dark night of the soul, where we live, it's nothing to see a deer, baby. But I got on my truck one night, and um, <laughs> it was late. It was late, but early. So it's a mama deer, like, literally this far from me. Now, mind you, I backed my truck in. So where the hell was this deer like legitimately two minutes ago? But I got out and I went to, I picked up my purse, which I hardly ever carry if I'm just making a run. And I turned around and it was a deer girl. I, I don't know. I must be talking to a girl. I was frozen in fear and I couldn't even scream. So someone may be not realizing that your consciousness your vibrations are rising and you're like, why is all these animals always coming around me? Like you sh uh, swatting them away. I'm seeing cats, um, squirrels, whatever. You may be like trying to get away from, but they, they just keep seeming to be around you. It's because your vibrations are raising dear. That's all that is. That's the universe talking to you. Listen, just listen and it'll all work out. So th that's y'all's little chuckle on me today. That shit. It was crazy as hell. And I told my kids, I was like, any other time, y'all hear me coming back with food. And y'all did not care about my little self. But they was like, well, we didn't know. Okay, so magical blessings. And this is three. So there is three people in this card. That, that to me signifies some kind of celebration. These blessings are a celebration of you. Whatever you are going through. You're being assisted by magical fairies' blessings. The fairies say you can be blessed. You can bless others too. Ooh, Lord, this sounds like a pay it forward. Now, the other day, I ran into a, a situation. 
5.15 on the timer. Ran into a situation. It wasn't bad. Somebody was in line with me. I was at the grocery store. Somebody was in line with me, but I had already interacted with this gentleman throughout the store. Like, just kept running into him. And I didn't even pay no attention to the last minute. We ended up going into the line together. It was me and my oldest daughter. And basically, you know how you got, like, a budget? So I was like... I, I seen him fumbling. It wasn't because I wanted him to hurry, but he was like, okay, just take off the black pepper. And I was like, oh, honey, hand it here. I'll put it on mine. And he was like, no. So what I ended up doing was paying for his order, right? It was it was nothing. It was, when I say nothing, baby, we blow that. I blow it in gas. I blow it doing anything I want to do. So it was nothing. And he was like, God bless you. And I was like, I hope so. Thank you. That's not why I did it, though. I did it because... We kept interacting, and I, I, I felt the genuineness in your situation. Now, anybody else probably couldn't have got it, but for whatever reasons, the universe spoke to me and said yes. So it was what it was. So you may come into a, a moment where you want to bless someone. It could be with your time. It could be with your wisdom. It could be financially. Yes, mine was financial, but I bless people with wisdom all the time because I love when someone blesses me with wisdom. Because to me, that is genuine as as hell. I'm going to say how I feel. It's genuine as hell. Because in this day and age, people want to keep you ignorant so they can manipulate you. And I have a brand new found appreciation over the last eight years of my life with people that bless me with wisdom. You stand out to me. Okay. So the last card is solitude. Think of being alone and meaning your... Hold on, y'all. These words are small. Think of being alone. As meaning you are all one. Oh. And the total harmony within everything. The greatest treasures are those that await silently during your quiet times. Y'all, I've been telling people for probably the last, on my mama, the last, my baby boy would be 10, the last 10 years. I've been telling people I am my best friend and my favorite times is being alone. It really is. I'm a social butterfly sometime, but baby, I'm a cancer. Ooh, y'all got protection. I love that. The fairies of protection are shielding you with a magical fairy ring of love and light. Yes, talk to me nicely. I love it. Precise psychic protection before embarking upon a spiritual, any spiritual network. Okay, y'all. You are protected at this time, but you need to do your due diligence. Cleanse your energy, pray, and sage, and keep your vibrations high. Okay? Let's go ahead and um, get a little tarot out here. Let's see what it do, baby. Ooh, y'all, I love this. I love when, when it all come together, like what I'm feeling this is probably the first birthday in the last five years that I was not sad for my mama's birthday. And this is a beautiful reading. I got sage on the desk, y'all, as always. I thought I cleansed it off. But I was not sad. I didn't. I did cry, but it was my daughter sent me a very deep, my oldest daughter sent me a very deep message of appreciation. And, you know, my mama used to say, give me my flowers while I'm alive, meaning just appreciate me. While I'm here, don't wait till I'm in the ground and I can't hear you. And, you know, she used to tell me and my brothers, because I'm the only girl. She used to say it all the time, but she used to tell me I act like them. Like, don't be so closed off and let your feelings show, which I'm still working on it, but, you know, you know. I love for me that my babies are so much better than me. They have grown so much. And they're, you know, they're doing so well, opposed to what I felt like I was doing for them. Spirit guys and ancestors, show us about stargazing, please. Oh, baby, this is the chariot. We moving forward with victory and success. Big cancer energy out here overall. Oh, what y'all going toward? What y'all going toward? Yeah, you know it's yours. Oh, that makes me feel happy. Spirit, tell me about nature signs. Okay, now, it's a lot of signs. This is not a bad card, and I don't feel like that for this particular clarification there's a lot of signs that are coming to you at this time with the seven of cups you got to pay attention now all of them might not be what you think they are okay 
But pay attention, y'all. We can we can get through this together. All right, Spirit. Tell me about... Okay, then. I was going to say, tell me about magical blessings. The Page of Pentacles. Small offer. Something, something new may be changing, okay? So there may be finance. What I said, I had to bless somebody because it was I was led to do so. There may be, you may do a small financial blessing that may be, bring you some kind of joy because the threes are about celebration for me. I mean, and it's not like, oh, I helped somebody. It could just be like, oh, hopefully this person gets a few moments to not worry about something because that was really how I felt like. When I seen Big Buddy in the stove, he was counting his groceries. I was counting my groceries as I was going through the store because I knew what I wanted to spend. But some of the things I wanted was on sale. So, okay, y'all, sorry. That is my business line. Okay. Some of the things I wanted was on sale. So, of course, with the things being on sale, I really didn't take a loss because it, I had this number that I was going to spend, which evened out to the number of both our groceries together baby so you may do something small for somebody but it could be something so big because if you look at the page of pentacles yes that is a pentacle but look how big that pentacle looks in their hand okay so think about it that way you might be like oh i don't do it because it's small you don't know how a person is going to be receptive to anything you do and that's on me, y'all. I love our family. I just, I got to take a moment. I'm in my in my heart space right now. What they say, them cancers. Yes, baby, I love our family. I do see the messages, y'all. I see the messages and I love that. Thank you. I see the comments. I see how we comment with each other. We take care of each other. And I love that. Spirit, guys, and ancestors, tell me about solitude. What's solitude? Okay, now. The thing about solitude, somebody, and this ain't for all of y'all, water sign. Somebody feel like being alone. You have not accepted being alone. You feel like it's a heavy burden to be alone. But you need to change your mind frame because you're not alone. You are all one. Okay? The card says, think of being alone with the meaning of all one. You are all one. You are all you need, baby. You don't need nobody else staying on business. Don't be hanging on to people because we got now we got the <laughs> we got the four of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Don't be hanging on to people because they don't deserve girl. This is somebody. Look, <laughs> I don't know who this for. Who this for? Okay, y'all. Now this is why I said what I said. And it could be a girl or guy, y'all. Y'all know me. I love everybody until I don't. <laughs> And that's for real. Okay, so we got the four of pentacles. You're hanging on the motherfuckers. I'm sorry for cussing. Now you got your heart broken with the three of swords. They done stole from you with their sneaky sales with the seven of swords. What did you learn with the hair fine? Oh, God. I can't even beat y'all. This was me a, a few, two years ago. Two years ago, hanging on the people I wasn't supposed to be hanging on to. Got stole from, from some of the closest people to me. Got my heart broke. And I, it wasn't even what they stole. It was the fact that it was somebody close to me that I never. Oh, they would never. They would never. And they show as shit did. More than once. <laughs> and stood in my face. Like, and what you gonna do about it? I said, oh. Alright, I killed you. But then, you know, I got babies. I can't say that on here, y'all. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't say that. But in fair defense, this person is really, really related to me in a way that if you know, if you ever heard, if y'all from down south, y'all done heard, I bring you in this world, I take you out. So you should know who it was by that analogy. Not to put nobody on blast, but I never speak on them. It's not, it's not anybody that I'm dealing with right now. Gotta fix that relationship if it's meant to be fixed. But if not, I handed that person back to God because that's what I had to do, you know? Sometimes you got to pray to people, pray for people and I'm back to God or whoever you subscribe to. I wish them well. I wish them well. But yeah, so y'all, I be loving me some y'all. I do. I do. 
And I be just, I don't want y'all to feel like y'all all just spilling y'all heart to me in the comments and stuff and think I don't interact. I do. Y'all, I done been through some things. And now I understand as a reader, which I fought off for about a, a year, really. I put it off. I was scared, everything. But as a reader, I'm here to let y'all know. I'm just like y'all. I done been through things. I think we go through it first so that we do get some of the wisdom but still even at that i'm teachable and i'm learning through this experience through y'all through what i go through through the wisdom that y'all share with me and i'm always grateful and appreciative of people that want to bless me in a good way <laughs> okay <laughs> spirit guys and ancestors tell us about stargazing and the chariot cancer energy victory tell us about it oh no we got the sun out in reverse Somebody is trying to dampen your joy, I feel. I don't feel like this is us, so let's just keep going. Spirit, tell me about the sun, the empress. Because you're about to birth something new. You are nurturing and creative at this moment, baby. It's way up right here. It's way up. It's saying your creativity will flow freely if you sit down and... Let's see. Let's read the card again because I'm going to do it. I'm not going to hold y'all up now. When you gaze at the stars, you give yourself fairy focus. Your intuition will flow more freely. Now, the, we are water signs. We have strong intuition. Let it flow. And it will reveal what you need to know about your situation. And I feel like with the chariot clarifying us how to get the victory out of whatever the situation is. But with the sun in reverse, somebody may be trying to block your victory. They trying to damp They can't block it. They can't block it because what the universe has for you will never miss you. They trying to dampen your joy. So somebody trying to rain on your parade because you are birthing new things. This could be a baby because this is the world. You may be on the world wide web. You could be like a concrete content creator that came out in the collective. Somebody was um, somebody's mother or a mother figure around them was trying to like deter them from being great or something. Y'all go watch that. They'll be, they'll be up around the same time, probably before this one. Um, but basically, somebody trying to run on your parade, don't let them, because you this is your victory. Spirit, tell me about the Empress and the Sun in reverse. A Queen of Swords. Okay, now we know the Queen of Swords is analytical. This card does say strategic, but this Queen of Swords is upright. You may be using your discernment and figuring out that, like I said, to the collective, um, somebody that's basically sneak dissing, somebody close to you is trying to sneak dissing, giggling, like, oh, you can never do it. You can never be successful. You can never die, 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 die. But, you know, ultimately, there is victory for you. This person see it. They don't want you to see it. That's what I'm feeling. So tell me about the, okay, the Queen of Swords. We got the Two of Swords. You've made a difficult decision and because you recognized an opportunity. Now, with it coming in sideways, y'all, Two, two of Swords, which is what? The Libra Moon. So you may want balance is what I'm feeling. Okay? You may be trying to figure out how to have balance in this situation. Trying not to piss these people off. But listen, baby. Just move accordingly how you should move. And the other one I was cussing. Yeah. Go watch that. <laughs> Go watch that. Because <laughs> I got in my feelings. Um, okay. But the Page of Coins is definitely your victory comes from recognizing who you are as the empress but it's gonna all open up i feel like a financial opportunity it's gonna be stable it's gonna create some kind of stability for you with the empress it does not mean that you are giving birth to like an actual baby it could be an ideal it could be a business y'all i didn't finally got off my but and then did some things and that that done took off y'all i love it i love it here I still make sure I make time for y'all. I still make sure that I'm having an attitude of gratitude. So somebody needs to know that you need to, you know, thank your ancestors, your guys, and, and the people that are in your corners that you don't see as well for the blessings that are coming because, baby, they magical. I'm hearing they're magically delicious. So somebody may create um, cuisine. Somebody may create cuisine. Magically delicious makes me feel like food spirit tell me about the seven of cups to nature signs we got the hermit 
Okay, what I told y'all, y'all trying to fight off these nature signs. Y'all trying to be in solitude. I don't want to touch nothing. I don't want nothing over here. I don't want to see nothing. Look at her. She like looking outside. Like, yeah, I don't want to go out there because the people out there type situation. Baby, it's time for you to come out of out of hermit mode is what I'm, I'm feeling because there's so many doors that's opening up to you. People need you out here. Come on out, baby. Come into the out. Come into the out, as my baby say to me. Can I come into the out now? Yes, you can. You done did your soul searching. The universe is offering you things. Just be due diligent. And with the, the queen of swords, you do know how to use your discernment. You listening to your intuition. I don't know what I'm doing with that. Okay. All right, spirit. Tell me about the hermit. Two of cups. A perfect partnership. Whatever type of partnership this is, it's going to be perfect for you, baby. It could be... Something as simple as a job. It could be a friendship. It could be love. I don't know. But y'all are water signs. So it don't, you know, put yourself where you go. Spirit, tell me about the two of cups to the hermit. You have the six of coins in reverse, which is um, somebody was trying to take something from you. And that's over here with this two of swords. So I don't, I don't know if it. Let's just ask, Spirit, what are they trying to take? What were they trying to take? They're being, this This bout came in reverse, so I'm going to take it in reverse because it was not straight crossing. I'm going to take it in reverse. They were being unfair. They were biased about something. Okay. So, like I said, these friends that really ain't friends, baby. Mm -mm. Don't keep giving to that. You've been in hermit mode because... This is right up under hermit mode. It's not for you to stay locked away. They want you to stay locked away so you don't step into your purpose. So you miss these opportunities. And that's not what the universe has for you. Because as soon as you get beyond it, you got the Page of Pentacles, a brand new offer, some kind of stability for you. And it's going to be a heavy burden for them. Because they're going to be like, but how did they get out their head? You got the ten, of, the ten of Wands out here twice, baby. They, they like, how did... But how did, I can hear somebody now. Spirit, talk about magical blessings and a, pen, a, ten, a page of pentacles. We got the chariot out here again, baby. Cancer energy moving forward with victory and success. You are moving toward your victory at this time. Spirit, tell me about the chariot. You preserve, persevering, having willpower. I'm feeling like just like running shit over. Big boss energy. Big boss energy out here, baby. That's what I feel. And the judgment, upright. That's good karma for me. Good karma. You know what I'm feeling? Y'all. If you look at her, you initially see one side. Because I don't think I focused on both sides. Never. Somebody is looking at you one type of way. Right? Now, I don't know if y'all can see my shirt. It says bad and bougie. It's an older shirt. Yes, I am living in myself today. I'm just chilling. But somebody may be talking about the old you. Now, I have nothing against tats. Y'all see me all the time tat, tat, tat it up. But someone may be trying to use something against you saying, oh, you got tattoos. How could you be a content creator? You got tattoos where they can see how you going to apply for a corporate job. They going to think you a thug. And I feel like that could be for a male or a female. But the other side of you, there's a whole other side of you, baby, that they don't want to acknowledge because they don't want you to see it. Baby, these ain't friends. These are your karmic lessons. Spirit, tell me about the judgment to the chariot, baby. Y'all, go watch the collective because <laughs> i just said these are not your friends these are your karmics baby this is the queen of cups over here with judgment yes it came out after the knight of cups in reverse the the knight of coins in reverse which is the knight of pentacles in reverse unbalanced action they want you to be off kilter so that you cannot achieve the things that you want because they are that way they are karmic and they are not doing the healing now this could be a mother figure. This could be a baby mama. This could be a friend that is a mother. I don't know. It could be an auntie. 
it could be anybody. Put people where they go, baby. But what I'm feeling is what I felt when I said way over here, go watch the collective reading. Somebody is really on BS with you. They don't want you to step into your purpose. They don't want you to be greater than them is what I'm hearing because they see how bright you shine. Baby, when I seen this card as your overall energy, I didn't got this card a thousand times, but this right here, I not really paid attention to until today. And it's so effortless. This could be a male or a feminine in this energy where you attract and you glow. And somebody don't want you to have that. They don't want you to know that you have it is what I keep hearing. Somebody's trying to keep you undermined or silly. Spirit, tell me about the Queen of Cups in reverse to the Knight of Coins. The star. It's a bright opportunity. They see it. I keep saying bright. Something about baby, your light is shining. Keep doing it. It irritates their demons. Now, this is going to be a good opportunity for you. And that's over here with magical blessings. Okay. It's going to be magical. The star is also about getting your wishes fulfilled, baby. Tell me about solitude, spirit, please, before we go. We got the moon. Something that's hidden, okay? Spirit, tell me about the moon, please. What's hidden? That you confident? They don't know how confident you are. This could be a male or a feminine energy in this queen of wands confidence. It's just being ambitious, being confident, knowing that you're going to achieve everything that you put your mind to and be successful. Because right here, we got the chariot again birthing something that leads to success baby it is going to be successful and i stand on business with it spirit tell me about the queen of wands to the moon the emperor now this could be a male or a feminine as well it could be an emperor in your energy but i really feel like it's you standing in it into your emperor energy the emperor is a leader somebody that takes charge has a plan they're effective Oh my goodness, Lord, it might be your emperor. You got the empress to the emperor? Standing in your confidence might call in your emperor, baby. And you could possibly birth whoever is for. You could possibly birth something great. A baby or something else. It don't matter. Y'all could possibly work together, y'all. Put people where they go. But understand, whatever your universe has for you is going to be amazing if you stand in your purpose and that's it. Spirit, tell me about the emperor, please. Are we not supposed to know about the emperor? Or was that it? Tell me more. We might not supposed to, <laughs> we might not supposed to know about this emperor. Y'all, y'all see me? Y'all see me over here trying to figure out. Okay. Oh, okay. Problematic professionalism. The eight of coins in reverse. You're being a perfectionist. You cannot be a perfectionist. I don't know if I showed y'all the card or not. Sorry. You cannot be a perfectionist in this situation. You have to let release control. Okay. It's going to be in divine time. And spirit, tell me about the eight of coins. It's going to be a ten of cups situation ultimate love and happiness okay something is leading to your ten of coins all right spirit one more can we get some oracles out the dough for my loves for my water sign loves i love this this is beautiful i know y'all can't see me but i'm trying not to mess up the spread <laughs> mm, mm, mm. whoever this is Baby, stand in your power. Don't let nobody strip you. I'm here and strip you of your power. They want to leave you naked. We're not doing that out here. Big water energy. Y'all know when water flows, things move. That's just a thought for y'all. Okay? We cut through mountains and everything. They can't stop us. Spirit guides and ancestors, give me some for my water sign loves, please. Give me one. Thank you. Baby. Baby. Because I can't make it up. Success, y'all. Sick. Mother. Sis. 
I said what I said. <laughs> for y'all, okay, this ain't going to be for everybody, but I've been saying this all morning. I'm sorry. I'm about to cuss y'all. I'm just going to give y'all a heads up. But there's a meme that is on, um, it was on Instagram. It might be on TikTok now, but it's old. It's an old, old meme, probably like three, four, five years old. He said, we got to be thinking big, bitch. We got to be thinking big. That's what I heard when I read the card. Success. Success. I know that there is no greater goal than to love, baby. Love yourself. Love what you're doing. Know that success is for you. Water signs. It's on us. It's our time. I feel like we up next. Somebody know what they supposed to be doing. Somebody know there's fakes around them. Somebody is pushing you to be great. Stand on it. Stand on it. And you got an emperor in your energy you are going to create with. Or you may be your emperor and your empress energy may be balanced. I'm not sure, baby, because everybody don't want a relationship. But most of the time, when you ain't looking for one, baby. That's kind of when it happens. Pippity, pippity, popcorn player. All right, y'all. I love y'all to death. I wish you health, wealth, prosperity, and abundance. But above all things, y'all, I wish you love. So until next time, I water signs. I love you all.